students, it's The Stitches, and today I'm going to show you how to add pockets to a side seam of a skirt. Recently, I made this blue skirt out of some leftover fabric from my Lolita dress. And right after I put the waistband on, I realized I'd forgotten to add the pockets that I'd cut out for it. And I realized that this was the perfect time to make this video. So to start with, you will obviously need your skirt. This particular skirt is made with three panels. So there's a center back panel and then two side panels. I'm going to add pockets to the two side panels. So first we wanna open up that side seam with a seam ripper. Be very careful if you're not already used to doing this. Honestly, the seam ripper is your best friend. And if you're putting together a sewing kit for the first time, buy two just in case you lose one. Basically, you just want an opening that's a couple inches larger than your pocket piece. So here we have some vaguely pocket-shaped pieces of fabric. I wasn't super precise when I cut these out. You don't really have to be. Nobody's gonna see it but you. This is also an excellent time to use up some scrap fabric. So if you want a super cool and crazy pattern on the inside, again, nobody's gonna see it but you. I find the best way to visualize what you're going to do here is to flip the skirt inside out and then we will pin the pocket piece to the seam allowance of our skirt seam. You want to make sure that you have the right sides of the fabric together and that the seam allowance is meeting up. For me, I can really easily tell this by using the serging line as a marker. And now we're going to want to take this over to our sewing machine and stitch it down. Sew very close to your seam allowance edge. You don't want your seam to stick out further than your seam allowance because then your pocket fabric will stick out a little bit and that just looks really unprofessional. So now we're going to press our seam allowance back towards our pocket. It's best to do this with an iron, but I have pretty good control with this cotton. And then we're going to pin our pocket together, right sides together. You might need to finesse this a little bit. Sometimes they don't like to line up exactly. And then we're going to sew this as if the pocket is part of the side seam. So you're going to sew down, turn your fabric when you get to the pocket seam allowance or the pocket stitch line if you have that designated on your fabric piece. And then you're going to sew the seam of the pocket, the seam that makes the pocket the pocket instead of the two weird little flaps. And then turn your fabric again and then finish off the rest of the side seam that you opened up. It seems kind of weird and like this shouldn't be how it would work. Kind of like the first time you make a princess seam, but trust me, it works. And now we have our finished pockets. So this is a really easy DIY and it adds a lot more functionality to your clothing. I think the bane of my existence is not having enough pockets because sometimes you just don't want to put your phone in your purse and then you just, what, you have to carry it around everywhere? No, just put it in a pocket. And we all know that women's clothing is notorious for never having pockets. So hopefully this has helped you out. And next week, I will also be showing you how to add pockets to the fake pockets in jeans. So check that out when that comes out. That's all for today's video. I hope everybody thinks about some clothing customizations that they might want to make. And I hope everybody has a good day. And I will see you all next time. Bye!